Well, good afternoon, good afternoon, good evening, good morning, whatever time it is you're watching this, and uh, welcome to the Riley School Little Thing. Um, I've been uh, involved with the Riley School of Irish Music in Cincinnati for quite a few years. I'm driving up there from here in Kentucky to teach uh, tin whistle and flute over the years. So I am um, very happy to see that they're going strong after 25 years and I wish them all the success for the coming few years. Um, so I thought I would just for a bit of fun, I will play you a little tune that happened came about uh, while I was teaching at the Riley School. So one day I was up there and the tune of choice that was being taught that week or I was teaching was a very well-known um, Irish jig called the Blackthorn Stick, which uh, everybody knows. Beautiful old tune. Well, I, I, I introduced it and started to play it and I saw a few people kind of, you know, sniffing because they, they knew the tune already and they were a little bit burnt out from playing it. So, um, you know, I thought, what could I do to... Uh, to uh, spark it up for them. So I, I stopped playing it as a G and I went straight into it in four time, four, four, rather than six, eight. And uh, straight off the top of my head, I've never done that before with this tune. And uh, it, this tune came out, a nice little fling, and I was very happy with it and I've played it ever since. So here's the, the Blackthorn stick played as a jig and then as a fling uh, that all came to fruition one Saturday morning in Cincinnati at the Riley School. So here you go, the Blackthorn stick. There you are. It's a little uh, little tune for you. Uh, anybody spot the mistake in the in the B part towards the end? An F sharp appeared rather than a G, but uh, I just left it anyway. Never mind. Um, okay, and I'll uh, play you another couple of tunes on the flute. Now, um, obviously, when I'm up at the Riley School, I'm teaching Irish music, uh, jigs and reels and horn pipes and barn dances and who knows what, but. Um, sometimes I like to stray a field, uh, further afield, and uh, whet their appetites with a, maybe a tune or two from another tradition. So today, for you guys and for, for them as well, here are two tunes from Galith Galithia, the Celtic corner of Spain. Um, a very simple march, and then a muñera. Uh, I think the, the tune's called Ruada. Anyway, it's a really great tune. It's, um, it goes down to the sea sharp below the D which I don't have so I'll have to pop up the octave for that one and by the way if you're if you're trying to play along with this the, this is an E flat flute so um, don't uh, don't kill yourself if you're playing in a D on a D flute you won't be able to do it anyway here we are so um, I'll finish off I just want to keep this short and sweet with uh, two tunes from Galithia as sometimes played in Cincinnati 
by myself. There you are. So good luck to you up there in Riley land and I uh, hope to see you again soon face to face. It's been a while since we could uh, do lessons sitting across the table from each other but uh, that will happen again I'm sure. Okay so good luck and all the best.